Mann auf der Mine Humpen meines Alters. to get on the other side. Ah! 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 Ah!
The other side must be barred. Come, help me with this. Sigurd, kill this sweaty fishwife. Stay your blades. This traitor Giedrich will face trial, as will all the treasonous thanes of this shire. You're the traitor, Edwin, calling on Alfred of Wessex, begging for his army. Clap your mead hole, Giedrich, lapdog of the Danes. You'll sell us out to Wessex, and that poxy-ass bastard Alfred. We won't have it. Lady, there's no need for slaughter. We all want peace for Xenifortshire. Can we find some agreement? You heathenish fork-tongued Dane. Foul-smelling heap, I shit on you all. Lady, choose your next words with care. For you see before you the future master of all England, Sigurd of the Hungry Raven Clan. Lay down your arms. Free my friend here and kiss my lordly feet. You will not get a second chance. Sigurd, are you cracked? And you can kiss my rosy red ass, Wayface. I've done with this offal. I leave them to you. Flay them alive and tan their flesh for saddles. What have they done to you? What kind of mess did you get yourself into? To fight. You should have freed me. Giedrich, this is Eivor, my stone-armed sibling. Well met. That was your plan, Sigurd. To charm the lady with your vague hope of kingship. Prophecy, Eivor, not hope. No time to squabble. Edwin's taken most of the Shire's thanes. She has her way. They'll be dead by supper. Tend your wounds, Giedrich. We'll free your friends. And what of the holy woman, Fulke? You promised us a meeting with her. I did, aye. But it's a fair mystery why you'd want to talk Where is with... she? Thane Holt will know. Fulke lives on his lands. But he'll be dead with the rest if you don't stop the trial. Tell us where and we'll go now. Their lives depend on the speed of your tongue. Southwest of here, halfway to Oxenaforda, at the Leich Vila garrison. Basim, Eivor, to horse! Again, Eivor, you and I, with blades drawn and hearts ablaze. Who is this Fulke that Basim spoke of? An ally. Most important ally. A holy woman who trades in prophecies and secret knowledge. That is not the sort of alliance we're looking for, Sigurd. No, it's even better. You cannot imagine what discoveries await. You're speaking strangely, brother. Because I'm alive, Eivor. My heart's alight with the fuel of battle fire. Like old times, eh? Yes, Sigurd. Like old times. Remember our hunts beyond the northern way? Our first big kill was a ten-point deer. We brought it down together. The arrows from our bows like darts of ice. With sharpened shin bones for skinning the beast. You on the right, me on the left. Struck! We crashed to the ground like a felt tree. Then the bloody struggle. Damn animal bit my hand. Never knew a buck could bite so hard. But I pierced its throat, spilling its lifeline into the drifts. That put an end to him. Such tales your siblings tell. It was the glorious dawn of our lives. 
You haven't yet explained who this Fulke woman is. When the time is right, I will. She is the fulcrum of a larger plan. Above conquering England, what larger plan could be neat? Patience, Abel. Patience. Fine. Keep your dread secrets, brother. If this alliance fails, you may take them to your grave. This fever will break once you know the whole truth. I promise you. Must be blocked from the other side. Requests have come in while you were away. They're always looking for help, so come back any time. Yeah. Stretch your wings, Sunan.
Pass the trial. I should not be seen in this area. They are about to execute the prisoners. Need your eyes, my friend.
switch open, would ya? Stay close. I'll help the others. Get me out of here. Edwin will have me flayed alive. to get on the other side.
Keaton sent me. Let's get away from this place. safely over there. We fought with our Weasley Elton for years. Now his widow wants to lop off our heads. Bless you all. Thanks to you, I live to pay Lady Edwin back in blood. I am Thane Holt. Does Giedrich live? He is safe in Buckingham. Good, Thane. We are at your side in this fight, to keep this land in the hands of those who love Mercia, be they Saxon or Dane. God in heaven knows I'd sooner see a Dane married to my daughter than sell a man of Wessex one of my pigs. If Giedrich is behind you, then I am too. We're told you know of a holy woman, Fulke. Where is she now? Can we not fixate on this cipher, Fulke? Edwin is our focus. Fulke holds a secret that may turn the tide of this fight. Without her, I cannot achieve my full purpose here. The madwoman, Fulke. If you want my backing, brother, you'll explain yourself. How is a madwoman central to your plans? When we find her, I will tell you all you wish to know. Until then, nothing. Understand this. Fulke is a heretic, a sower of poisoned knowledge, and an enemy of the Church. She claims to have seen or spoken with God himself. And for this, Lady Edwin had her imprisoned. I know not where. At a monastery, I suppose. We should make inquiries. Sigurd, do we not owe Gidrich some word of what has happened here? You can speak with him in my stead. But we must hurry. Fulke's life may be in danger. We risk losing all the gains we've made here for the sake of this woman. Trust me, Eivor. Fulke is of great importance. You'll soon understand. I hope I will. We have a camp to the east at Linforta, an old harbor on the Great Ouse. Meet us there. We Thanes will raise a feared and join with you to take down Edwin, whatever it takes. Bring this news to Giedrich. Tell him we'll be ready when he calls. Every man will be needed. No soldiers here now. Gidrets has cleared them all out.
She's well supplied, that's for certain. Well, oil jars, spring old arrows, fodder and the like. Take what's useful and burn the rest. Giedrich. Eivor, do the Thanes live? Every single one. They've set out to raise a fear of fighting men. They all stand with you, Giedrich. We'll need every pike and poker we have to take down Edwin. And you, and your brother, are you still with me? I like your bluntness, Giedrich. My axe is yours. My brother's too. Edwin's plopped her haunches down in her castle now. She has men and supplies coming. Curse her eyes. Where is your brother and the odd fellow? They continue their search for the woman Fulke. He seems to think she will help us chase Edwin to an early grave. But I do not understand how. You do what you must, Eivor. I'll ready what men I've got for the coming fight. I'll move towards Kinnabella Castle and bring up the feared for an assault. Edwin's fortress is strong and sure. Is there anything I can do to weaken her grip on the Shire or make her anxious? Ah, there's a notion. You could ship away at her flag bearers if you see them and defend my feared if any are in strife. We stole some of her supplies here. If you find any other stores like this, destroy them. That I can do. When you're ready for war, you'll find me at a camp near Kinnabella Castle. Surveying the area, Sunan.
What I've learned about Fulke, she... And here's Eivor. Ah, you've timed things well. The Holy Woman Fulke is close by. Imprisoned at St. Albanes Monastery. Just around the bend. This is our moment, Eivor. After this, everything changes. I might be pleased for you if I knew who this woman was and why we needed her. I have explained enough. Now is the time for action. You've done nothing of the sort. Nothing but give me your blind word. I wish to speak to her. Me. Your Jarl. That alone is reason enough. Why? So she might cast a spell and turn Eatman into an eel. Fulke is not the only advantage we seek here, Aver. There will be treasures in St. Albanes. More than we can count. I have already plundered St. Albanes Abbey and lifted its treasures from nave to crypt. I saw no prisoners of note. She is there. I know it. And she is the most valuable treasure of them all. Eivor, there was a time when you would follow me without question, because we trusted one another. Because you knew I would never lead you into folly, never wager our lives before I knew the cost. Is there something that holds you back from embracing me as you once did? As your brother? Your family? Sigurd, you know I would never betray you. Y your trust in me. I'll fight with you, but there must be limits to this chase. Gidrich is counting on us. Of course he is, and soon we will deliver. Come. When you raided St. Albanes, are you sure you saw nothing? No crypts, no prisoners? Nothing I can recall for certain. What do we know? What see you, old friend?
What do you see, Sunan? They have moved her. No. It is here somewhere.
through here. At long last. dares enter this sanctuary? This stony cave reeks of piss and salty tears. How dare you? We've come for the woman Fulke. She need not bedevil you any longer. Oh, the mad heretic! Ah, the self-begotten spirit has sent an angel to deliver me. Open the door. Her heresies must be punished. Not by Danes or Mahometans, but by true Christians. Choose, Friar. Stand aside, a fight. If we must come to blows, my lord will protect me, and my reward shall be assured. What? <laughs> Praise the lord of the treasury of light for this chance of deliverance. Are you sent by the angels of Sacklus? Or the self-begotten one above? That I cannot answer. You are the woman called Fulke. I am Fulke in this realm. A humble seeker of the self-begotten one's true nature. And you are a collector of artifacts? The instruments of the children of Sacklus the Fool. Yes, I am. I have many such curiosities. And you possess an object? A polished stone with unusual markings? Now, you're a curious one. A cowl and robes hiding tawny skin, and that devilish blade. Why do we linger here? Soldiers will be coming. There are stables beyond the monastery where we can speak in peace. Lead the way. Come. Imprisoned. Some weeks, perhaps a month. For your so-called heresies. Heresies, yes. I have been blessed to discover many profane objects in my lifetime. Objects which attest to the works of the Demiurge, the false god worshipped by these robed imbeciles. Across Germania and Francia, I found these relics and carvings. And here in England, too. Lady Edwin claims they are blasphemous, but her mind is clouded. The true worth of these objects is immense. May we see these objects? If you wish to know the truth of our origin... Enough of these mysteries, Sigurd. Fulke is a curator of objects of great worth. One of which may reveal my true nature. True nature? You said this was about victory. About defeating Edwin. To know that I am descended from the ancient gods is a victory. It would give me dominion over this land. Descended of the gods? Brother, what by Odin's eye are you saying? Fulke, we have heard that you possess a profane stone with strange markings and the image of a tree. That I do. A monolith I call the Saga Stone, for it came to this land with the Dane Ragnar Lothbrok. Do you have it? It is the sun and moon of all my sacred objects. Will you buy and trade this stone for an alliance? Or more fighting men? Is it useful for anything other than flattering yourself? Perhaps I should leave you three alone to hammer through your differences? We are unified. We only wish to see the stone, to read the runes inscribed upon it. No one on Earth can read those runes. The language is... Unknown and probably long dead. There is no risk in letting us look. No risk at all. Praise thee. O oh, self-begotten one for sending these three to deliver me from my punishment. No whispering god led me here, Fulke. I brought myself. You came because I called you, Eivor. They spoke through me. Brother, you have my head spinning. And you fascinate me more with each passing moment. 
The Saga Stone is hidden away in the care of my acolyte. Are you ready to go see it? The sooner we see this slab of rock, the better. Let's go. Approach the stone with an open mind, Ava. You may find it more interesting than you expect.